So hello audience, today we have Shushma with us. Shushma has completed BSc and MSc in biochemistry and she is from Bangalore and she is starting her career in IPR and patent industry with Banana IP, which is one of the top IP companies in Bangalore. So congratulations, Shushma. Thank you, ma'am. So Shushma, we'd like to start from the very beginning that how was your journey from BSc, MSc, then uh, joining the JOPAD program and uh, starting your career in IP? Uh, actually, it was wonderful. Earlier, mm -hmm. I didn't have any experience in IP or any knowledge about IP. Mm -hmm. As soon as, uh, after completing MLC, I was open to the regular options that was available, like for lectureship, research, or entering into pharmaceutical companies. Uh, uh, somehow, after finishing MLC, I didn't want to enter into research because it would take a lot of time to get a PhD, and I was also not having any uh, fellowship. And uh, for uh, in order to, sorry, that's out. okay. That's okay. Uh, in order to, it's the power problem. Sorry, it's okay. It's okay. No worries. No worries. Uh, so after completing my MSc, I wasn't uh, interested in getting into PhD because of the fellowship problem. I had to uh, sit and study for NET exam, and then I had to get a fellowship, and then I had to enter into PhD. Uh, so I was very reluctant to get into PhD and then I went into pharmaceutical company option. Mm -hmm. uh, there I worked for some time uh, in uh, pharmaceutical informatics. Mm -hmm. and then I left the job and then I got married and eventually was again searching for jobs. Mm -hmm. um, after some time uh, coming for Bangalore, I uh, knew I came to know about IAPTA from a random recommendation from Naukri. I didn't have any knowledge about IP before that. And after that, Astham contacted me and told about the complete structure of the uh, JOPAT program and how the patent analysis work uh, goes on in the industry. And then I was um, uh, slightly, I was reluctant again to join the program because this was the new field. I, I didn't know anything about this. And uh, somehow my husband researched about IABTA and one of his friends also knew someone who had interned here. Okay. So he recommended this and then I got some confidence and then I contacted Asthama again a couple of times and then I joined uh, IAPT and now I'm very happy that I made a good decision. All right. Awesome. So when you moved to Bangalore and earlier because you were working in pharmaceutical company, so were there any days of struggle in which you were like confused and trying to find a job for yourself in Bangalore? Uh, when I was working in my earlier company, I was very, uh, you know, um, happy with the job. Mm -hmm. the, but somehow I was uh, thinking about expanding the knowledge, like uh, getting, uh, growing into the field. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, somehow I felt it was not, uh, I, there were no scope of expansion in that. Okay. And after that, I had to leave the job and I was searching for something else. And then I some, uh, got into uh, uh, internship. Okay, great. Awesome. So when you transitioned from a pharma company, because you were feeling that you are stuck at some point, right? So uh, why now, because you are entering into IP, why, why do you think this is a good choice for you? Because what was missing, what you got in here? So what is a comparison? How we can compare these uh, things? Yeah, um, earlier I was thinking wet labs would be better. Uh, okay. Working in a laboratory would be a better option. But from the from my place uh, to getting into a wet lab, the communication is, uh, uh, you know, uh, traveling time is uh, very much. Okay. So all the bases of wet labs are like outskirts of the city and okay. it would take a long time. So I wanted, I was searching for a, that kind of job uh, where I would get flexibility mm -hmm. and uh, where there would be a working from home option also. Okay. And some and some uh, job that would uh, help me grow as a professional. So uh, somehow I I felt that IPR would be a good option. I think mm -hmm. this is not a recommendation. I just uh, made a try. That's it. And I'm very really happy for uh, making that decision. Great, awesome. So as you told me that initially you were a little reluctant about IIPT joining it, that whether it will be good or not. So now after becoming successful, uh, doing the program and getting a job, what is your uh, opinion or what is your review about our program? Uh, like I completely loved the structure of the course, how it is designed. Uh, basically, I was used to the method where we study in books or in PPTs, in documents. Mm -hmm. 
here the structure of curriculum was given in form format of audio mm-hmm. and it was also given in uh, live hackathon live sessions and hackathons as well so this was something new uh, mm-hmm. it was uh, i became curious in learning and the fa- pace of learning was very fast in this format that that is what i felt mm-hmm. uh, compared to books and uh, you know uh, in written format this is uh, ma- much uh, fast learning process so and live sessions were very helpful to me uh, you gave some very valuable tips which were uh, i included all those tips and because of that i got very uh, you know confident in answering the questions in interview or anywhere else mm-hmm. so uh, some tips were about uh, how to uh, you know deliver answers or how to uh, be, uh, become a professional like uh, you know uh, updating the resume or linkedin profile this one these were some tips which we don't get anywhere else so you quoted them and told us and i just followed those tips that you told in the class and nothing special i did i just uh, followed those tips that you told yeah and that's what i always say it is easy you have to follow some steps that is so congratulations yeah. shishma i'm so proud of you and banana ip is one of the very top company in ipr and definitely you are going to get good mentors over there so i think dr kalyan is heading heading uh, uh, banana ip right now and he's a he's a very yes. learned professional in and very respected professional in our industry so i am i'm hoping that you'll have a very fruitful career ahead of you this is just a beginning you are that you're doing and i'm um, kudos because generally biochemistry and chemistry students generally don't opt for ip because they don't understand but you have taken a very good step and i am very hopeful that all your professional goals will be met so <laughs> as a part of a small gift to you we would like to offer and i would like to extend my mentorship to you uh, in training you for the patent agent examination next year thank you so much ma'am so you will receive this gift from our uh, support team they will contact you and they will let you know that how we how you can progress in future and this is a small gift so it's a 100% scholarship so that program will be free of cost for you and we want you to grow into this industry thank you so much ma'am thank you shishma and th- i'm really thankful to your husband and entire family who supported you during this journey thank you ma'am with your blessings i'll i'll expect uh, progress in this definitely shishma thank you so much and congratulations thank you ma'am thank you bye bye